The European Regimen Accelerator for Tuberculosis Project, known as ERA for TB, is a public-private initiative devoted to accelerating the development of new treatment regimens for tuberculosis, a condition that impacts more than 10 million people worldwide every year. Our project began in 2020, funded by the European Commission's Innovative Medicines Initiative with a budget of over 200 million, making us one of the largest TB research programmes in the world. In ear for tb we have developed a stable platform that advances compounds from candidate to phase one, human clinical trials, in less than half the time it currently takes and for less than half of the current cost. This platform uses the latest technology and is creating the new ones in the form of novel methods and instrumentation for drug development. In the last three years, the consortium has made many contributions towards TB drug discovery and development. One contribution the consortium has made is to put together a very impressive pipeline of assets, of compounds and drugs um, that, are, that have potential against um, drug-resistant TB and really drive forward their development in a very efficient way, even taking two compounds into the clinic. ERA 4 tb has um, allowed or has permitted the consolidation of a network of six CTUs uh, to perform first time in human and phase one trials. And so the idea now uh, moving forward is to maintain that network, not only to perform first time in human trials, which is what has been done within the consortium so far, but to also uh, conduct other phase one trials such as drug-drug uh, interaction or combination trials. So the main contribution from the uh, individual package is the capacity that has uh, been created by building up a platform of new and innovative technologies like the hollow fiber system, optica, the granulomalic structure or the host pathway interaction platform that uh, have been implemented and optimized in different laboratories. And this uh, uh, integrated with the modeling and simulation activities will help to better predict the efficacy of new therapies from uh, preclinical data. Another major achievement has been the implementation of sophisticated animal models. So there's a variety of these which have been used and that mimic uh, human TB. And we have a variety of uh, non-human uh, primate models, uh, the macaque model and also the marmoset. And this is the first time that uh, the marmoset model has been used uh, for TB research outside um, the United States. So that's, I think, a major um, innovation. The impacts of, uh, of era 4 tb in the field of TB will be noticed, first as short-term and also long-term. Short-term assets that have been developed, platforms that can be used elsewhere, and in the longer term, what we are doing is progressing new molecules that will change the way TB is treated. Since, uh, we, since we have created unique capacities for drug progression, uh, we hope that this expertise uh, will benefit TB researchers beyond the duration of era for TB. So uh, the future is a sustainable public drug discovery platform accessible to anyone that can be extended to another uh, antimicrobial resistant activities and or also to neglected diseases that currently lack of uh, sufficient resources. <laughs>